what's happening explorers okay as you could see from the front this is a bluestone cottage I just found it I've been trying to call out to see if there's squatters in here because there is stuff everywhere and it looks like a lot has been left behind I filmed a bluestone cottage in the same area yesterday uh, late 1800s this would have to be the same but this one is in far better original condition with the uh, classic Victorian archway there check it out so I've called out I haven't had an answer so let's go let's check it out Yeah, I, ha I actually haven't filmed the front yet, but you've seen the front because I've filmed it at the end, if that makes sense. Because there was a, there was a lot of neighbours um, hanging around, walking up and down the street, so I just ducked straight in the driveway and in the door, because I could see the door open. Actually, we'll go in here first. Still a fish tank there and everything. Let me check this power. The power is still on. Let me turn my light off. The reason I checked that is I think I can still hear the the filter. Oh well, if um, I su surprise a squatter, it's not because I'm trying to. Or if one comes back while I'm in here, I guess I'll just deal with it if it happens. Doesn't look like someone's sleeping on that bed, no way. So. I hope there's no fish in there. No, there's not. Yeah, I can hear that. It's still plugged in. Another random find. It's the random ones that are the best ones. The cottage I found yesterday in the same area was totally random. And bluestone as well. And I couldn't see any wall cracking in the other one too. Maybe there's some slight ones there. It just looks like People have packed up and gone. Well, not, not even packed up, just gone. Hello, anyone here? Definitely a ladies' bedroom, this one. If 
if you can hear voices, voices, it's over the road. There were, there were a couple of guys playing table tennis in the driveway. I wonder what happened. They've just left everything. There is dust. But it's not like... Now there's a phallic symbol. There is dust, but... There's also rat, uh, not rat, mouse poop on the bed. So no, no one's sleeping on this bed. Hmm. Some nice pieces of furniture there. Books. There was lots of lots of books left behind in the one yesterday too. A swag. Oh, there's one for the ladies. Herb Ritz. Now a swag, someone's asked me what a swag is before. It's kind of like a big sleeping bag with a mattress attached to it. And you get in it, you can unroll, unroll it and uh, lay it down and just sleep in it. On any surface basically. Love these old archways. This is a narrow, a narrow room. Looks like a study. Definitely just a study. It's all stationary computer stuff, invoices. Haven't found a calendar yet.
Whoa. Check out this kitchen. The light is being left on. Maybe it's been left on for a reason. Well, it's the perfect time for squatters because the power's on. I just want to check in this room. Okay. This may be the one room where there's actually someone staying. Alright, if they're out, I hope they're not coming back in the next 10 to 15 minutes. Look at that cabinet. I have bumped into squatters before and um, it's all been good as long as um, you explain what the hell's going on. Usually they've, they've thought that I'm either from the demo crew to come in and tell them that the place is going down. So I haven't really had a bad experience bumping into squatters but at the same time you can never really predict what's the outcome. Mm. Doesn't smell real good in here. Also, um, squatters tend to have a few houses that they sort of bounce back and forth from. Do I really want to open that? Oh my god, does it even open? Whoa, what a catch. Reflexes, still got them. Uh, that must be a sign not to open it. This this thing's rattling in there. I'm just not going to. Um... No, I'll try and check a date on something at least. Let's go for the the butter chicken, Master Foods. Best before August 2021. Okay, so that's still in date. Oh, uh oh, there we go. No way. That's not uh, being used to store anything. Don't really want to breathe that in either. Okay, we've been in there. And this light's on as well. So if the power's on, look, there's washing detergent, fabric softener. Both, both on the power points, so... The further we get into this house, I think there's more proof that someone is using this house to squat. 
and this just looks like storage. There's an old LG. Looks like there's just a whole bunch of invoices and stuff in here. Hmm, that's all got dust on it, so I'm not sure. I've got the backyard here. Just turn the light off. These things. The pegs have got cobwebs on them, so I think they've been hanging there for a while. All those seats are dirty and dusty. Okay, well, we have covered the whole place. So I'd be pretty certain, almost certain, that there is someone coming and going from here, squatter. And when you think about it, if you were homeless and needed a place to squat, this would be a great house because the power's on. It's just a shame it's so trashed. Hmm, but I guess there was definitely a family or there's renters in here living and like we've seen in so many other places on YouTube, exploring, they just up and leave. And we're always wondering why. Alright. Well, on to the next one, hey guys. I'll say thanks for watching. Jump in the comments. And we'll see you in the next video. Cheers, bye.